And when you start choosing people for leadership positions, whether it's to serve on a board or in a key um, executive position in a big company, um, you know, there are people around the table who decide who that is. And there are often people who, they have their guys, or they have their people, and they're arguing about, well, I think my person should have that job. Well, I think my person should have that job. There are people in the room who are advocating about who should be the best person for that job. And so this is something that has gone on for centuries with men. And a lot of men are very reluctant still, I believe, to be that strong a public advocate of a woman because I even think there's some of that, that sexual stuff that people will think there's something going on there. You know, there's all that stuff about, oh, she, uh, you know, she used her feminine wiles to get there. That stuff is still floating around, but I think men really have to be courageous about leaping over that. 